Yes. Hmm. What's wrong? Nothing's wrong. But I'm just trying to um um put some ice on my lip because it's bruised and it's um swelling up because he was outside playing football. Um and Hosanna was just being herself um and just trying to tackle me and stuff, but then she like grabbed me and held my arms and then kicked me and I fell and she had my hands, so I can't put my hands in front of me, straight on my face. Okay. Um, but I'm fine, just trying to get the swelling done. Babe, how often do these lot come in with like cuts and bruises and knocks and scrapes? Well, I was gonna say really often. What it is usually though is that I kind of find out about them in the evening, like at bath time or whatever. I'll be like, oh, what's that on your leg? Oh yeah, it was just when we was playing football, so and so knocked into me. I think <laughs> I saw and someone's leg had like a bruise down the front of it the other day. I was like, what happened there? I was like, oh, that was just Hosanna. No, I'm joking. It's not only Hosanna. <laughs> Uh, but they are very rough and tumble with, with each other. So, but it's good though, you know, it teaches them how to be strong, which yeah. is great. But when um, that happened to Hezzy just now, because obviously when you cut your lip, there's quite a lot of blood. Um, so I was in the, I was upstairs and Tim was like seeing to him in the utility room mm -hmm. and I could just see the bloody tissue. I was like, oh, what, has he knocked a tooth out? <laughs> and I was thinking that is not very good timing for what's coming up for him. Like I was gonna be like, oh, typical. Like it would have been so typical. But hey, it wasn't a tooth, which no. is good, which I'm pleased about. So the plans can continue. What are you going to ask no, me? I, no, I was just going to say, Hez, what have you got coming up? My brace is fitting tomorrow. Okay, all right. Which You're... I've had to wait two years now for because mm -hmm. we went two years ago. I was yeah. too young, didn't have all of my adult teeth yet. Yeah. Now I've got all of my adult teeth, went back, then there was like, Oh, we're just looking at it. Wait another year, come back and see if you can get it done. Okay. And tomorrow's the day. Tomorrow's the day and yep. you're very excited about it. Yeah, yeah, I am. And here is the culprit. <laughs> I'm, I'm, I didn't mean to. Basically, so we were playing football, and I'm not a very good, skilled footballer. Hey, so I just have to. I, I just, think that's underselling yourself. I, well, no, no, no. It's just the truth. I'm a strong player, but I don't have as like the skill that Hezzy does. So I can't just quickly nick the ball. So what I done was I grabbed like I I so I grabbed one of Hezzy's arms. Yeah. And then I like so imagine you're on the ball. Ruth, pass me your ball. Please. Please. Hezzy, just one. Wait, 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 wait. <laughs> Ruth's coming. Um, and I grabbed one of his hands. Then I went like, from here, I kicked his leg that was on the floor. Yeah. And he obviously went like that because he didn't, he, and this leg went up. So he, he just went like that, and the other foot was on the ball. Yeah. And he just went straight and smashed his face on the floor. And I just thought, I just was like, oh my gosh, did he knock a tooth out? Because it was a really hard hit. Yeah. We both went down on the floor, but I didn't hit myself on my face. I just went onto my back, okay. but he went straight into into the floor, and I thought he knocked a tooth out. I was, I was so scared. But then I just saw lots of blood, and I was like, oh, Oh, it's for you. It's not his tooth. It's just, it's just a bit of his lip. But usually, <laughs> but it's just you've, you've like what's called hit your lip lots of times. Hit your nose and your lip together when you're trying to do a backflip once at our house, and you hit into the. The brown chair. Yeah. That was you guys would have saw that. If you're, yeah. If you're His OGs. nose went huge. Oh my gosh, that was the scariest one for Hezzy. Yeah, that was mad. Like we thought it broke his nose because it like was like a golf ball on his face. <laughs> we vlogged that, didn't we? Yeah, I we, think did. we did. Yeah. Look back through our videos, you can find it. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, yeah me and Hallie were crying in that one. And then um, more recently, not recently, but like a couple of years ago, he was in the tramp in the trampoline place and he down off his nose and his lip again but thankfully this time it was just his lip so mm -hmm. yeah so yeah. that's fine if you ever play as strong as you can that's totally fine yeah absolutely like if you ever this is gonna come it's gonna sound a bit weird but if you ever hurt someone you want to hurt hezzy because he doesn't make you feel bad but oh, he's, just, he's just like no he's, he's like football because like he's just like oh it's fine he just got up like this because I think he he got knocked a tooth, he thought he knocked a tooth out as well. No, but he was I, just like, I didn't know he knocked a blood. tooth out. I know I just hit the floor very hard. And you know when your lip goes cold or something goes cold mm -hmm. as soon as you like hit it and you think, oh, I think it's bleeding now because all of the air just yeah, goes yeah, straight yeah. into it. I felt that and I was like, okay, is it bleeding? I was touching it, it wasn't bleeding, but then it just... A gush of blood just came. <laughs> yeah. Hallie yeah. was uh, really. Hallie, Hallie makes asking. me laugh because Hallie ran in <laughs> and I knew something was wrong with you. Like, I was like, why is she running? Like, you should have seen how white. You know those um, funny animals with the really wide eyes? Yeah. Do you know oh, them? The bush yeah. I, I bush yeah, is it? Is, yeah. it, is, it, is that what it is? Yeah. Yeah, yeah, so, yeah. Yeah, those ones. That's what Hallie looked like when she came in. Uh, and I was, yeah, it, but I was like, and she tried. <laughs> 
tried to hide it. What makes me laugh so much is they try and not tell daddy what's happened. Oh. They're like, he, he, she tries to just come in discreetly, just grab problem. some tissue and just run back outside. But I happened to already be coming back outside mm. just to see you guys and see how you were getting on or whatever. Oh, but um, yeah, and then I'll see. Possible. Has been over at the, um, like, so, so just out here, like we've got a, yeah, like a hose pipe or whatever, and he's washing out his mouth. Oh, damn. <laughs> yeah, and that's what, exactly. It's very resourceful. I think it's because he didn't want to come inside, right? Yeah, I didn't want to come outside, come inside, sorry. I didn't want to bring the blood because there was a lot of blood at that point anywhere upstairs or anything like that. Yeah. So I just went over to where there was some water that I could wash it off with. Yeah. And I just used that. And done, simple. Yeah. Um, and also, so you said, so tomorrow is the day to get your braces. Yeah. Um, you're excited about that, obviously. Yeah, do you want to see my teeth? Um, yeah, why not? What? Uh, oh, are we, are we looking like, at like a profile? Yeah, so as you can see the top ones, they're a lot further like forwards than the bottom ones. Mm -hmm. so hopefully the braces do their job and put them in line. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, it'll be sick. Yeah. Um, I, I think we'll we'll get a bit of what you look like tomorrow yeah. Yeah. Um, as well. <laughs> um, but yeah, like literally. Ali, are you still in shock? Because you no. are very really quiet. No, I'm just here. Yeah. Really good. Are yeah. you sure? Yeah, I'm yeah. fine. Okay. You need some comments. Do you think she's alright? Yeah. Are you what sure? do you think it's going to look like with braces tomorrow? I think it's going to look different. good. You think it's going to look good? Yeah. Not. Yeah. Di I don't think he's going to look that different. I just think he's just going to look. He probably might look a bit older, like a teenager, because most teenagers oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. they have braces. But yeah. It's funny, right? Because he was reading up about it this morning. Because there's, he was when we went to his last consultation, there was like, oh, there's different types. What ones do you want? So like we were kind of looking up this morning about what the different types were. And he came across this. He can't say so shit love. He came across yeah, this right up. The summer was like talking like so, you know, your teeth are out of line and it's time for you to go and get them sorted. You need to get braces. Now a lot of people might feel and um, what was the word they used? Like self-conscious yeah. about braces, but don't worry. Yeah, we talking about the family photo at Christmas. It was that the holidays always come round and you have to take a family uh? photo, which you're always dreading every year. I'm like, no, I'm not. The family photo is totally fine. And I've been wanting braces, so I'm going to be like, cheese! <laughs> <laughs> Yeah, so it was like trying to help people not feel so conscious about having braces. Sorry, I need to turn that off. No, that's right. off. But I was just like, really? Are we that like in the world? Like, if someone needs something like that, is it that big of a deal? Like, if you need braces, you need braces. I think um, Vanetta Lynch, as an adult, this is one of our old, old friends, yeah, yeah. she got braces as an, as an adult. Yeah, she looked good with them. Yeah, 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 if you want to yeah, fix yeah. your teeth, fix your teeth in it. And don't, sorry, it's going to be smoke. Don't, <laughs> don't like sacrifice getting your fi your teeth fixed because you think people are gonna look at you funny. Like the way that you present yourself and the way that you feel confident within yourself mm -hmm, is, mm -hmm. I think, is what will be portrayed to other people. Absolutely. And then, yeah, you'll be like, yeah, I'm fine with it. Then other people will be like, oh yeah, yeah, it's fine. Mm -hmm. Do you know what I mean? So I know his isn't gonna feel a way about it. So that's mm -hmm. good. Thing. I, I don't think any... Do any of our children feel... Do any of you lot feel self-conscious about anything? No. no. Like, anything at all? No. No? No. Like, genuinely? No, I don't. Because I think this is quite powerful. Like, you know why as well? You know what I always hear? I always hear a lot of time that mixed race kids often feel like... I don't know, like they maybe don't know because they're a mix of both races. They don't know exactly where they fit and all this I kind of stuff. Like Go on, bro. I yeah. haven't been black and I haven't been just white, yep. but I feel powerful being mixed raced because yeah. I can fit with everyone yeah. and I've got the best of both worlds. Yeah, absolutely. And I, I'm confident in myself. Yeah. So, yeah. And, and, and isn't that key? What about you, House? Same thing as what Hensi Yeah. Saying. Yeah, yeah, same. Yeah, and you're the same as well? Yep. Okay. Well, yeah, like, I, I, I honestly think it's just a case of you knowing you. Do yeah. you know what I mean? And, and, and Like, if I get bruisings or cuts or mm -hmm. stuff, and people are looking at me, I'll just tell them, oh, I got this from so-and-so. Yeah, got exactly. This from that. Like, Do you know what? I'll, I'll be totally honest. I, I, think, um, I, I think that you guys and uh, Mummy as well, Hughes, down there. You okay, baby? Yeah. Um, I think you guys are genuinely the most confident people in yourself that I've ever met. Like when I and when I mean that is I mean like what uh, you would you say? You as well. Yeah. Oh, thanks. Um, like I do. Yeah, I I do 
I, I genuinely like being me. Um, but yeah, you're right. Like exactly how you described it. Like if at the end of the day, you know, you got something, something happened, yeah. then something happened, didn't it? Yeah. Like and it's life. It's life. Like and also, it's usually not permanent. Yeah, yeah. Do you know what I mean? Yeah, but even with my um, when I done that thing to my nose and I bust my nose, I don't think I don't feel like my nose has ever gone back to as small as it was. Mm -hmm. But I'm totally fine with that. That's cool. Like, we'll like work that. with a new nose. Yeah. Like <laughs> and, and that's it. Like even when I go barbers, like sometimes they go, "Oh, do you want to do this?" I say, "I can make that work." Yeah. Like, do you know what I mean? I that's. Yeah, I, I I totally agree, yeah. and it and that has always been something I've I've observed of you guys, and I think it's fantastic, and I hope that it would encourage others out there as well. Yeah. But just what I was saying, sorry, I said something just a minute ago about not being able to change. Uh, sorry, being able to change, like if you get a cut, yeah. generally it's gonna heal, right? Yeah. Like and stuff like that. Yeah. But at the same time, sometimes like things like who we are, like our race and whatever, we can't change. Do you know what I mean? But I want, I don't want to why would you want to? Yeah. Like exactly, right? Yeah. Like why yeah. in the world would you want to? You happy being you? Yeah. Hey, Harper, right? Yeah. 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 Even when it comes down to some things like looks, I feel like some people get self-conscious because maybe they might not like be what the world typically says is pretty, whether that's a man or a woman or whatever, mm -hmm. yeah? I think um, Viola Davis had something about this. Yeah. So I don't look at Viola Davis and think that she's an ugly person. No way. At all. Like, I think she's a beautiful, she's an black, incredibly strong woman. She's an talented woman. Yeah. Very, and, and also that's another thing. There's different ways of being attractive, I, I think. But for one, you're never going to be everyone's cup of tea. So like, uh, and I'll just explain that in layman's term. You won't be for everyone. Not yeah. e everyone in the world wouldn't think. Oh, someone, someone is gonna think. Tim will think I'm the most beautiful woman in the world. Absolutely, hundred. Somebody else might not. Yeah. But who cares? Which like, is okay. That's absolutely fine. Yeah. Um. But basically, what I was saying. So I think, like for example, Viola Davis. She's had a lot of stigma. I think as you know, showing apparently like so kind of like taking off her wig, taking off her lashes, yeah, crying, yeah, yeah, crying yeah. ugly, like who cries pretty? But yeah, uh, <laughs> like yeah. crying ugly and snotting and all this sort of stuff. Mm. But that's obviously only been used like as a strength in her acting. But mm. like obviously she's come up against certain things in her career that she's now just honed for herself. Obviously she's had to like be strong within herself as a person. And obviously yeah. she's had other things going on in her life. But yeah. there's even who's the, <laughs> who's the actor who's in the King of Scotland? I can't remember his name. Uh, but um, he's got a bit I of a know, closed eye. Exactly Put it in that. the comment section below if you can remember. Not more Whittaker, than three Forrest, Forrest Whittaker. Whittaker, yes. So again, like he's got like a closed eye, yeah? I don't know what happened to his eye, but you can see this one that's different to the other. Someone could have looked, he could have looked at himself when he was younger and been like, oh, or whenever, whatever happened, I don't know what age. Mm -hmm. I think, oh, you know, I can't be in front of the camera. You know, people are not going to want to look at his eyes. Da, da. What is he doing now? He's one not of the even biggest actors to any of ever. that rubbish. So I say all that to say, when you look at yourself in the mirror, no matter what size you are, no matter what bits of flips and flaps you might have, like you've got to just be confident in who you are, who are, you are as yourself. Now, at the same time, if you decide you want to do something about it, fine. But always be happy within yourself as you are, do you know what I mean? Yeah, to start yeah. off with, if you want to go gym, if you want to go and put makeup on or whatever, but don't hide behind those things. No. Like, <laughs> I wasn't going to share initiation, but I won't do that. But oh there are some <laughs> things that you just have to be confident within. Like, if you're going to go on holiday, don't be like, oh, I can't go enjoy myself on the beach and put on a swim costume yeah. with my children. Yeah. Like, because of my, what have you, but anyway. Uh, no, 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 you're not. <laughs> um, also, what is also good is that the fact that when you've had, because with you, the groom gang of scene that you have let your whole um, you know pregnancies and births yeah. and all that be seen uh -huh. Precisely. like and you haven't like been funny about that yeah like, but you know what I mean? and surely that uh, that must speak to so many people please put it in the comment section below yeah. if you are you know, you have been positively affected yeah. by what I you've seen on our channel. Been. I hope so. Yeah. yeah. I hope so. But I think it's also really important for young people to even look at our kids and take 
strength in that. Like they are confident in who they are as young people, whether they have to get braces to get their teeth in line or not. And also, can I just say this was him? He wanted yeah, the yeah, braces. Yeah, because I'm gonna say like even when, when you look at Hez, Hez has got an absolutely lovely smile. Yeah, I've always said that since he was younger. Um, and because it's usually like when you see people in pictures that you realise, oh, like they've got a really nice smile. Whatever. You always just smile. When you smile, you smile from ear to ear. <laughs> Hello, Ali. Um, you smile from ear to ear and it looks great like and, and I'm fine with my smile yeah um, yeah but and but but you I don't really know why you even wanted braces that much maybe just something to neither do neither do I really I just I just think it's because something else to try okay yeah okay. just that really and that's okay yeah that's okay yeah I just um, like the look of braces yeah <laughs> well there you go that's fine too if you just like the look of something hello gorgeous girl say hi hello Wayla Hello, you pretty little thing. Um, yeah, so, um, yeah, well, guys, we have over talked because we are all the way up uh, about 15 minutes now, but um, yeah, it's, it's yeah. been nice talking. Yeah. And um, we hope it's been an encouragement. And, are we going to. Um, let the camera so, gang have to see the braces on another. Yeah, so what we'll do is we'll do another. Like, I'll, when we go to get your braces, yeah. we'll just take the camera with us. Okay. Um, and, we'll, <laughs> and we'll do that. Oh, you dropped it. You dropped it. You what's it. All right. Yeah, we'll take the camera with us cool. and we'll show people, yeah? Yeah. All right, cool. Well, guys, we will see you on the next one. Love Be you. confident. Love yeah. you. Yeah. Peace. 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 Oh. Peace.